So what is a CIO CTO? There's no right, wrong, or even universally accepted definition of what a CTO chief technology officer is, or what a CIO chief information officer is, or what the difference between the two roles actually is. So what is a CIO? A chief information officer could be said to have a bias to working on the team rather than in the team. He or she might have a bias to look out rather than in from the IT tech team. He or she could focus on getting a positive return on investment from the company's technology spend. A CIO might dispassionately view the IT team as just one of the teams in the company that needs to be cost effective and deliver the company's business plan. He or she might read Forbes.com, WallStreetJournal.com and is thinking about doing an MBA one day. He or she might have come up through the less technical routes of service delivery, program director, project manager, etc. He or she very much views technology as a how, not a what. So what's a CTO? A chief technology officer could be said to have a bias to working in the team rather than on the team. He or she might have a bias to look in rather than out from the IT tech team. He or she should be passionate about existing and emerging technologies and how they can be used to create competitive advantage for their company. He or she might read Hacker News, Slashdot, and have a user GitHub account. A good CTO will have kept their core technical skills up to date. They won't have the time or experience to do every person's job in their team, but they will have maintained a core set of technical skills that are up to date and relevant. He or she might have come up through the more technical routes of architect, development manager, developer, etc. He or she is normally the lead technology evangelist and advocate in their company. Some companies have a CTO, some companies have a CIO, and some even have a number of people with one or more of these job titles across their usually large organization. What is generally agreed though, is that both of these job titles entail running a technology stroke IT team as the most senior IT person in the business. Of course, a company wants and needs both of these CTO, CIO perspectives to varying degrees or in different stages of its growth. That's why having both a CIO and a CTO might be an optimum structure once a company has reached big scale or big complexity. Section three quiz. Number one, how might we define CIO and CTO? Number two, could a CIO or CTO favor working on the team? Number three, could a CIO or CTO favor working in the team? Number four, please feel free to email herocioctoatgrow.team with what you think the difference between a CIO and a CTO is.